Hey friends, welcome back to the vlog. So we are in full newborn mode right now. Um, so that's why like, I look like this, but that's okay. Um, we are sitting outside right now in the garage. Just driving one hand. Elodie is driving her pink car around like a cul-de-sac. <laughs> oh my gosh, drinking her Starbucks. Hold it, just driving one hand. <laughs> She has her Starbucks in one hand and driving her pink Mercedes car. Out. Go oh lay down. Oh my gosh. She's Heavy, dying to put it down. Not here, dude. Not here. That might that might spill. Okay, did it already spill? No, she wants to hand it back to you. Okay. We're just chilling outside. Ben went and got Starbucks on the base baby. for us for breakfast. And like pumpkin spice latte and he got an apple crisp macchiato, I think. It is really nice day out it's sunny it's warm still but has like a little bit of a cool breeze and so yeah we're just trying to get out of the house and enjoy family time we have Lay oakley out. up here this Lay i feel down. like this accurately represents our life breakfast coffee toddler toilet for potty training hot sauce. <laughs> and then the newborn and hot sauce because <laughs> hot sauce. we all just a little bit fast <laughs> but this is oakley he's being such a good boy just chilling he's how many days old? Five days old now? Uh, Today's Sunday, and he was born last Tuesday, so like five. five, I think. So five days old, and he's such a good baby. What's wrong, Ellie? So he's just chilling in here while Ben and I eat real quick, and I'm sure we're gonna pick him up and love on him because we can't barely put him down. Dreaming so much lately about your face when you're smiling. It's the only thing that saves me. Mm -mm. Hey, I don't know if I told you that I think you're beautiful, and how oh, I can't wait to hold you. Yeah, you pull me up when I'm falling down, and I don't know what I would do without you. Yeah, you pull me up when I'm falling down. This is something that I know for sure It's just something about you I just want more Tell me what you wanna do right now Tell me what you wanna do tonight I really don't care as long as I'm with you Hey, now look into my eyes You can use them as a mirror, baby You're my ticket to paradise Everything's alright We've been longing for each other And it feels like I'm on cloud nine It's a little bit later We put Elodie down for a nap We're trying to get her back on her schedule and routine Because of course with my mom being in town And everything um, She got off schedule and she just needs her sleep. Like, the girl without her sleep gets a little crazy and whiny, and the girl needs her sleep. She right. loves her it's naps. It's like daddy without his sleep. That is so true. <laughs> um, so, she got from a nap, and we made a really quick grocery list, and we're gonna go to the grocery store. Normally, we do like a really big shop every couple weeks, and we haven't been able to do that because of Oakley's birth, but I also don't wanna be like walking around a grocery store for a while because I'm still pretty sore. I'm only five days postpartum so we're gonna just do a quick grocery shop but we have both the kids with us so we'll see how this goes Elodie or not Elodie Oakley wasn't liking his car seat at first when we were leaving the house so he She's seems to be settled concerned. now well, as, <laughs> as we, we say, say that <laughs> <laughs> but we have this cool little monitor which sometimes when the sun hits it the wrong way you can't see it as well 
ever see him as well, but we have that monitor in our car to watch him in the back. Yeah, he's busting a little bit. I think I'm just gonna try and carry him through the commissary. I really wanna get like a wrap for him, um, especially with it being like flu and flu season and COVID season and cold season. But he hasn't really seemed content in his car seat today. I mean, he's not doing bad, but. I think he just wants to be, it's a time of night where yes. he just wants to be held. I know, I was he thinking a, that already. He has a time of night, a time of day that he's just like, all right, y'all hold me now. Yeah, it's 5.14 right now. And just like this evening time frame, he just kind of wants to be cuddled. He, <laughs> did you just realize we were recording? <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> um, he just kind of wants to be cuddled and wants a little bit extra milk and so. Yeah, I think I'll just cuddle him to the commissary and Ben can do the heavy lifting. That's fine. <laughs> Which you need to do it. When you say heavy lift, I need to do it anyway. <laughs> You're only allowed to lift him. Yeah, so. But um, um, I'll take care of the toddler. That's pretty good. much the heavy lifting. That is the heavy lifting. <laughs> you could you could lift like a 50 pound cinder block, but the heavy lifting is still the toddler. <laughs> She's nuts. <laughs> as we walked out. Because I'm telling you, it probably dropped on the ground and someone picked it up and put it on the exit for us to see it when we exited because that's mm. like a parent thing. And they obviously see that Bubbles is very, very worn and loved. Thank God we found him. It's probably gonna be like on the Facebook page or something. So that he trip He does was, not want to be in his car seat. No, he just wants cuddles. I carried him like you guys saw throughout the entire commissary. We weren't in there for too long, but Definitely long enough for me. And um, he did really well in my arms. He just slept, but now that he's back in his car seat, he's like, no, I want cuddles again. But we were walking out in the commissary and these little posts, like right there, we um, <laughs> walked out of the exit and sure enough, what was there, bum buns sitting on a post, which Elodie has said, where's my bum buns? And then I was like, I don't know, did you take it in? Did we leave it in the car? Ben was like, I thought we had it. He was like, oh man, I'll go back and check. And then like we kept on with our trip and... And then I forgot to go back and check. Yeah, and so then luckily we walked out and someone had put it there and we found bum buns, so crisis averted. So it was a successful trip, but Oakley is ready to go home. We're gonna try to do a bath for him tonight. We have not given him a bath since we've been home. And his umbilical cord actually already fell off. Last night. Last night. So we are like, oh perfect, we'll try to do a bath tonight. Yeah. So we're gonna do his first bath at some point tonight. But we gotta get home before Ben's Patriots versus Bucks game. And his crying is stressing me out. And I know when I edit this back, it'll stress me out, so I need to stop recording. <laughs> Okay, so before we hop into bath time and doing Oakley's first bath and everything, I want to let you guys know who is sponsoring this video. And today it is being sponsored by Viore. I'm really excited to partner with them because they make shampoo and conditioner bars. Yes, bars that are made with natural rice cosmetics that will moisturize, strengthen, rejuvenate, volumize, renew, and gently cleanse your hair and scalp. So let me show you what these look like real quick. I've actually already used them, so you'll see them used a little bit. Um, and Ben has used them also, actually. This is their shampoo bar. It comes in this adorable little box. Um, I absolutely love this with the little handle. And it smells heavenly. It is like a citrusy smell that is just delicious oh my gosh like I absolutely love the smell of this and even when it's like sitting in your shower with the steam it kind of makes like your whole shower and bathroom smell just like this shampoo bar and it's amazing and then the conditioner also is in a bar form and the bars look a little bit different this one had they both been used so um the like imprint that was first on this isn't perfect. I'll actually insert right here a little clip that I did when they were brand new um, before I ever tested them out because I want to show you what they look like fresh out of the packaging, but they are beautiful and they're packaged so beautifully. And as soon as you open the packages, like you can smell their citrusy scent and it's just so refreshing and inviting and I absolutely love it. And it's funny because like I said, Ben's uses shampoo and stuff and he has literally like stolen it from me. He's like, I actually love that these are in bar form. Like I hate just like regular soap all the time in my hand, like liquidy soap. And he's like, I love that these are in bar form. And I agree. I actually like left my hair kind of natural for you guys to show you how much that is helped. Like my frizz, I have a, my hair is kind of like a weird mix between wavy and curly and yeah, it's kind of a hot mess sometimes, but like, look at that shine. Oh my goodness. And then 
also just like my frizz is way down. I feel like this worked wonders on my hair. So I do want to let you guys know that all Viore products are 100% vegan, plastic free, sustainable, sulfate free, which is a huge one for your hair, paraben free, cruelty free, pH balanced, and sustainably sourced. So we all love a company that has a great product, but especially this day and age, what we love even more is when a product has an incredible mission behind them. And that's exactly what Viore strives to do. So they actually partner with the Red Yao, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly, it's a Red and then Y-A-O on projects that they believe will help their communities thrive. Viore is really committed to respecting and preserving this unique culture. So in doing so, they make sure they pay a fair and sustainable premium for all Longsheng rice and products that they purchase from the tribe. Economic Economic pressures have unfortunately made the Red Yao culture vulnerable to extinction. So because of that, Viore has made it their mission to donate 5% of their profit back to help their community thrive and build stability. So this is a product that not only works, is great, smells amazing, both I love it and my husband loves it, but they also give back to the community and are making sure they pay it forward. So with that being said, I will have, of course, all their information down below in the description box. Their link to their website where you can read more about their mission and what they're doing and their 2021 goals and all of that good stuff. They have a ton of information on there and it is so informative and I think it would be really cool for you to stop by and just look through all the amazing things that they've already done and are continuing to do and have goals to do. I will also have a coupon code listed down there for you guys also. So make sure to grab this. This would be a great Christmas gift for a loved one because you're supporting a good cause while also giving them an amazing gift and who doesn't need more hair care products. I'm always collecting new stuff and this is a total winner in my book and we are constantly like having this in our shower. I literally had to take this out of our shower to film this because like I said, we use it all the time. I am going to now go get Oakley and Elodie and we're gonna go get ready for bath time and get on with our night and hopefully that goes well. All right, so we're about to give sweet baby Oakley a bath and we're actually gonna weigh him. We have a um, scale at home to weigh him so we're gonna put him on the scale real quick and see how much he weighs. I have to go get my phone to go weigh him. Oh, sweet boy. Oh my goodness. That's crazy. He's 7'10? 7'10. Oh my goodness, big boy. You already grow so him. much. Wait, save. 7'10.5. Aww. Alright, let's go get you in the bath. Alright, sweet boy. It's your first bath. You're gonna have it with your sissy. You ready for this? Let's see how it goes. He's like, I don't know about this. He's like, I don't know what's going on. Look how cute he is in the mirror. Aww. Oh boy, Ellie. Oh gosh. And then we get the top. This is gonna be interesting. All right, we gotta be very careful because baby Oki's coming in. Here, we can keep his passy for him. Okay. He can have his passy in the back. Oh, he's doing well. He's not doing well. He's doing well. Alright, do you want to wash him? Yeah, I like washing. Aww. Sweet sissy. You love your baby brother? <laughs> she loves like rubbing her head on him. No, you don't need your wubsies, silly girl. Just Oki. <laughs> no. Dad is going to wash him because, I don't know, I feel like you're more confident than me. Careful, in the water, please, Ellie. You're a good big sissy, Ellie. Oh my goodness. You're the silliest girl ever. So you're turning Oki's bath now? <laughs> you say, Dad, I chop chop. <laughs> my spa day. Just need some cucumbers for your eyes. <laughs> Are we going to weigh him real quick? Oh yeah, we can. He did since so we had a, well. Since we had a pee pee diaper on him. Aww. Hi, sweet boy. Oh, bless you. Hi. You 
you did so well and you're already calm. His eyes look better? Did yeah. I, did I get yeah. the booger out? There's a little gunk still left. We'll get it off in the towel. Yeah, we will. You want to go with yourself one more time? He's like, no, not really. <laughs> he really just want to stay here all cozy and warm now. We're done with bath time. Ben's just finishing up brushing Elodie's hair. And that like quickly became chaotic. Because I was going to grab Oakley's um, PJs and he was in just a towel and I don't know what I was thinking but he didn't have a diaper on yet so of course what happened he peed through the towel and on himself and on me and on his sleeper that I had just gotten out so then I had to get a different sleeper um, that was kind of chaotic because then Ben was handling Elodie and she was just being a crazy toddler and then Evie decided to go downstairs and eat the food off the coffee table <laughs> and so we were just on in like a big kerfuffle <laughs> but I guess that's what happens when you're new parents of two so now he's just laying right over here he's chilling I think he probably wants more milk but overall he did really well and we actually weighed him again because we realized after we weighed him the first time that he had his diaper on it and it was a little full so af right after his bath before he put the diaper on um, we weighed him again and he's actually 7'7 seven, seven. so that makes a little bit more sense. I was thinking 710 seemed really big, but you know, that's so good. But 77 is so good because his birth weight was 75. So at six days old, he is up two ounces from his birth weight. Um, so that's really exciting. I don't want him to get bigger, but that's good that that means he's eating and my milk is coming in well and everything. He's just being the bestest little boy ever. You got the hiccups a little bit right now. The lighting isn't too good in our room because we don't have the big light on, but. He's being such a good boy. He was so good in his bath. He's probably exhausted now. Oh, and then we had the crazy toddler. <laughs> hey, be careful, Loki. You are crazy. Like, she's just insane. How'd you do? Did you survive? I'm surprised and not thriving. So Ben just asked told me to ask you guys what you think of the beard because you never see him with a beard yeah. because he's on this leave. This is one week. This is one week of a beard. But I might try and stretch it to two. It really shows that it doesn't connect on the vlog right here. I, uh, <laughs> Turn your face. Well, I also shaved right here just to get it away because it felt weird being right here. I don't know. Well, yeah. I probably should have left it alone. I don't Turn know. Turn your face. Oh, yeah, that's better. I don't know. You guys let, let us know. Do you like the beard or do you not? I personally don't love it. I like him clean shaven. I'm gonna try another week. I don't know if I can oh make it. Oh my gosh, week, I don't so. think you'll be able to make it. I don't know if I can make it. It drives him nuts having a beard after a while. He acts like it's a great idea, but then after a while he's like, just kidding, I want this off. <laughs> it's true. It's true. <laughs> it's a cigarette. Good job. As much as Elodie Mama go. is a crazy toddler, she is a very good big sissy, aren't you? Yes, you are. <laughs> <laughs> and do you love Oakley? I just yeah. brushed this hair to be perfectly straight. And look at it in the back. Show the vlog I back know, it's already curly. Her hair gets so curly. So quickly. It's getting long, big girl. Her hair's so thin, though, and fine. <laughs> and our sweet boy is just chilling. Resting after that chaoticness. Yeah, it was probably a lot for him. Yes. He'll probably be out for a little while. Oh! Hi, big girl. I love you.